Ladies and gentlemen, game number one. Look at the damn mega random double TC Lithuanians versus Burgundians. What the hell? No, man. Seriously? Double TC, man. Holy shit, man. These mega randoms. Holy crap. And what do we prefer in, in double TC? Well, obviously, a Lithuanian start is so smooth with 150 foot extra. You don't even need to, to make the loom, probably. Well, you can see how Mr. Yo is doing the loom already. Well, it's a stress me to watch. So imagine, you know, imagine if it's gonna stress you. Yeah, man. Double TC start with new patch. Um, it should be the same. It shouldn't be any difference, you know? You don't get 200 foot with double TC start, in my opinion. You will get only 100 foot or not. I don't know. Maybe you're right. Anyway, the map is like, uh, well, it's a land map, not like Arabia because there's a big hill. Then you can make buildings here, but there's zero resources. Only those stragglers. Yeah. And then, standard resources. Two golds, two stone for each stone center. Not three then. Not a lot of resources in this map. It happens a lot in Mega Random. Maybe it's a lot of resources, maybe it's too little. You know, so let's see. <clears throat> you will get 200 foot, maybe. Well, that's something that they maybe they will have to probably uh, balance. Yeah, I will. I will just make a question here. Okay. Before I forget, I will do the question right now. Give me a moment. Okay, you can see that in this kind of games, guys, you have to adapt. It's gonna make the mill, and what uh, Mysterio is doing is walling all the map. Sito too. But well, if they do this, uh, I think Burgundians is a superior civilization. Guys, this is gonna be really fun. Can you tell me, guys, what it makes Lithuanians very strong, guys? When you are going with knights, what is makes Lithuanians very strong? Can you tell me, guys? The relics? How many relics we have in the map, guys? How many relics? <laughs> I fucking love it, man. Come on, spam everyone! Zero relics, man! Fucking zero relics, man! What, what the hell, man? You see, and this is open, you know? Nice hole here by Mr. Yo. Super Yo. With a hole. Why he's not checking? I have no clue. But the scouts are going for the hole. Yep. There you go. He's gonna wall all the map. And is he gonna find it? Oh my god. Well, Sito is. Uh, uh, uh. It's going up much quicker. And Mr. Yo, 
Man, seriously, this is a big black area, man. So now just click inside and you will see if you if you have a hole. You don't have to delete, man. Because it's open. And then I'm telling you something. Oh well, it's gonna go latest. It's gonna go latest. No matter what. Uh uh. Got it. Resources super strong for Sito. Double attacks, horse collar. No, he's gonna make the barrack now. Is blue finally gonna find the, the hole or not? The barrack is gonna be here. Okay. And blue. It still doesn't see if there's a hole. Crazy. Really crazy. Anything can happen. And now, got it. No! Just, why you go with both the scouts? Oh, he's a stupid red. Why he's going? Oh my god! Red! Hey, hambre! I mean, seriously. Why he's going away? Do you need the scout to survive? He said, hey, Mr. Yo, come and walk here. Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, make no sense to me. Anyway. You see how Sito is uh, on the way to Castle H now? He could have gone much faster, I think. But he's going now. And Mr. Yo is going fast castle too. So... Most of the double TC maps, most of them are going for fast castle. Because you get so many villages. Crazy resources from the start. Uh oh. Villier down. Yeah. He's a villier down. He should kill it. Yeah, and he got it. Because he's not a wall. And now, chaos. Some chaos. Two scouts. Go, go, go. No, no, no. Moving three ships. Both are going to go castle drop. What units do you prefer, guys? Ladies that ignore the armor or Custelier that have the craziest attack ever? My goodness. Make heavy plow also. You got the resources. No? I think Burgundians is much better civilization, honestly. I think... Well, I don't know in general, but in this kind of approach, like you got already all the upgrades, coal mine and upgrade even. No will borrow, so okay. But this is still open. And then the unique units are much better for for Miss Yo. But let's see. No relics in the map also. That's really unfortunate. You pick Lithuanians and then there is no relics in the map. Crazy. Yeah, this table is for just to make the the husbandry. You know? That's why it's stable. Basically. Stone mining upgrade. And well, maybe he's going to buy a hundred stone. Yeah, why not? 30C. And where is going to make the castle? Maybe here? Oh, he's doing a knight. He's doing knights. When the night has come, the villages are gone. All right. He's doing the knights. Interesting. And a monastery now. But the monastery is not to take relics. It's just to convert. You know? Red is doing the castle there. Extra 30C. And blue is going to drop a castle in top of that hill. To control the grass. Because there's nothing else. Yep. It is. Nothing else. Mining stone, and now he has a stone. Where's he gonna make the castle? He's gonna go forward? Oh. <laughs> He's going now to this area. Well, why to go to that area? Better to the right, that is... That is closer. And red cannot even see it. That's sick. There is a knight. Two knights, actually. But there is a latest. And now, 
Mr. You're gonna see it. So let's see the damage that that latest can do. You can see how the latest have more attack and it killed the knight. Clearly, as you could see. But will happen the same with the Custelier? No. It won't. It's gonna break very fast. Like really, really fast. And now the damage is gonna be real. But it is stone gonna make extra TCs or Oh! A second castle here! To protect all the farms. Okay. Eh. I don't like it. All the gold is exposed. He cannot see, by the way. But he knows that... Yeah, husbandry. Skill bar in armor. No, no, no. Just, just go for the castle. Yeah, he's already creating chaos. I know that the population is similar, but nothing is really happening. What is he going to do with this? He's going to go to Mangonel? Yep. To attack the TC. And still doing more and more Custelier. Husbandry, uh, Sanity, all the upgrades for both players. And Tuval is different only. But Burgundia Seco is sick. It's true that he has 36 farmers. That's a lot. That's really a lot. But Blue is going to create Chaos. He has the monks here. He's gonna come and trying to attack. He won't attack. He is well defended. Maybe he will wall juice uh, with the with the mill. Yeah, why not? And he's starting to try to kill the leaders. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. What? What the hell is this? Mi Ooh. Well, that micro, not the best for you. Definitely not the best for you. Did he convert it? No, but the knight is there. And the problem here is that he he is having like 10, 11 villages idling all the time, you know? Oh my god, that castle. Well, I mean, it's brutality castle and... And going to convert now nah, these custodians you're gonna see how good these custodians are he converted one and now the custodians will just eat the latest the latest the mangle is down okay but just go back a little bit and this castle is just gonna be insane it's oh my god he's buying another castle you get crazy amount of resources but there's another mangle he's gonna take this one it's not gonna kill the army he's trying to kill the mangle but he can't He's gonna move around with those or not? He should go to the villages or not? Eh? Maybe he should go to the villages, but he's not going. And now, and now, and now, Micro, yo! Well, yo definitely doesn't control the units as smooth, but Castle is up. And I mean, if he got two castles, he's taking all the farms, you know? No fletching though. And ladies and gentlemen, check Mr. Yo Economy, man. Check his economy. He's on the way to Imperial. How? I don't know. Insane, you know? Insane. Well, this civilization is sick. You know? And the good thing is that... He has never been attacked at home. Never been attacked at home. So his echo is smooth. No problems. Yeah, he's gonna try to get here. No, he can't. He's going to convert one, probably. Yeah, he will lose that one, but who cares? University is gonna convert another, probably. And... And... He didn't, but still. Even if the population is the same, I think this game is over. At least that he's doing full petas and kill the castles. Yeah, he's doing husbandry now. He's coming with a lot of ladies. But is better castle it's army or just go imperial? Obviously, I think go imperial. Now he's gonna go pikes. He's gonna go halves. Ooh, he converted another, but he's lost. He's going to convert another, and he will convert another. That's gonna be converted, or not. Ah, no. All right. Now time to convert. He's 
He's gonna come with a castle forward, but the surprise is gonna be real. And now Mr. Yoshi will do a castle here in this spot. Yeah, Mr. Yo, you make a castle here at home? Oh, it was open. It was open. And now he's raiding. Okay. Bloodlines, but make a castle here, Mr. Yo. He's gonna react properly or not? We will see. We will really see. Because the castle here is really needed. Halvard is plus two. The house will dominate. Why the castle here? Well, he wants to kill it from behind. Okay. That's fair. That's really fair. Yeah, but this army is just... It's just superior, man. It's really superior. I was thinking the castle here because you protect. And you don't let that he break the palisade and the house. And then come and make damage. But where's the traps? He's doing halves. Halberdiers. Halberdiers eat the latest. They do. As you can see, they do. Oh boy. This castle is not going to be up. Because he's not walling. And it's ridiculous that he's not walling. Why not? Because Mr. Yo is not walling, man. He wants to make the game go longer, it seems. Population is still more for Sito, but... Trebuchet will take the castle now. Yep, he will. Ay, ay, ay. And now he's gonna break it here. Is what I told you. He didn't finish that castle. Now he has the halberd this, and at home he can have some damage. He's gonna break it. 1,400 stone. What is Mr. Yo doing at home? Not too much. Chemistry, plus four. He's coming with the latest. Army more for Yo, but he's a little bit out of position, in my opinion, now. He's inside now, and... How he's going to defend? I have no clue. Block printing, played mail armor. He can lose now many villains with those latest. Like a lot. He has zero. Zero defense. Okay, he's coming now with the Burgundian's Custelier. But uh, pfft, he's raiding a lot. You can see the Echo KD. But even like that. What? What? He latest with my gunnels. Unbelievable. Still the army is going. Now chemistry, block printing. And the timing is so important. And you can see how, I mean, if he's doing a lot of army and has similar population, kill more economy, it, it seems that Sito has no chances to come back. He's gonna lose the castles, look at the look at the house. And I wouldn't be surprised that now Sito call it. When he lose those and lose the castle, then it's, it's impossible. Finally, now he's doing a castle here. Just take this goal and... He's just fine now. Oh my god. Okay. Look at the castle he's doing, Sito. At the back. He has okay population, Sito. Look at the other castles. Oh my god. Yeah, but he's losing all the map control. And he does have the gold. Yeah, it's GG, guys. I mean, I love that Sito is a try hard and he's trying. He still have a good population. But also this, this map without relics doesn't benefit him at all. Well, it's still raining. Just look at Echo KD, both losing. Uh-oh. Don't leave the traps, Lonely. Don't leave the traps. Just send the house with the traps. And bam. Yeah, it's still, it's still taking some, but... He's still fine. It's crazy. It's still fine. You can see, guys, how important it is to go up to Imperial faster, because... Actually, right now, I feel that Sito has used more resources than Yo in military. Just look how many ladies he has in the queue. So, if he wasn't doing this army, he could be in Imperial a long time ago. But, he feels that he has to make a lot of army to stop Mr. Yo. Trebuchet and helps. That's it. Castle is down. He's now on the way to Imperial. Exactly, he unqueued all those units. And then he's up. But when he reach Imp, he's gonna have how many castles, guys, when he reach Imperial? Probably... Probably zero? I mean, if he's going now forward, he might take it. Yeah, this castle is gonna go down. Probably. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He take one trap, but... Till the latest disappear... Okay. Oh, man, the trap. He just killed it, man. And the trap is 7 HP. That's crazy, man. Unfortunate. And now, taking this one. As I told you, he's gonna have zero castles. The game is over. Mr. Yo, 
in another level, guys. In another level. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he's not resigning, but 200 population, Mr. Yo. And Sito, what he can do now? Another castle, fletching. He's gonna go skirmishers, hand cannoneers, halves himself. And Mr. Yo doesn't have no mobility army. He has basically only halves, but an oath to destroy. And that trap, go, 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 GG. Mr. Yo did a domination, guys. A domination because his time up was fantastic. And his opponent couldn't do anything, you know? Anything. Yeah, the, you can see how the APM is much different with the previous series. Well, with, with Hera, Viper, uh, Winchester, 6260 is, is much slower. But decisions, man, decisions matters. And here, Mr. Yo with more kills, but the economy, economy was similar, as you can see. But he reached Imperial Age, man. While Mr. Yo never clicked it. Well, he clicked it, but it couldn't reach Imperial. Game two, let's go. Okay, guys. Game number two is now a map that is what? Sito with Persians, Mr. Yo with Turks. Thank you, man. 56 moons, man. Thank you, Paello. What the hell? Um, notice your start. Four picks. And uh, with four villages start. A slow start for sure. And we have Persians versus Turks. Persians usually very strong here. Like, very, very strong. They, they can fight? I don't think they can, but still. Both are doing dogs. And the difference is that Persians now... And remember this. is one of the last times that we're gonna see Persians... Guys, with these extra resources. Because if I'm not mistaken, Persians is gonna lose that bonus with the new patch. So then they cannot go with the extra fishing ship anymore. Is that correct or not? You have to tell me, guys. Because I think they lose the extra. Yeah, but if they get the extra resources after doing the TC, you cannot make the, the, the fishing ship early. And honestly... I don't think that should happen. Why? Because then Persians are useless in anything. You know? In anything. Yeah, but, but then they don't have it. The, the, the good start for Nomad either. So then why you want Persians in the game? We can remove them. Let's remove them. Yeah, delete it. It's still good on a free Lake Kawasan. Yes, maps that are only played in a specific tournaments. And never in the ladder, because those maps are never in the ladder. Maybe Kawasan has been. Free Lake? I don't remember. You know? Well, let's see. The patch should be around the corner, I believe. Really, really around the corner. Obviously, what do we prefer here? We prefer Persians. For the start. But if you don't make damage in the start. Then the Turks. Oh boy. Oh really boy. It can be dangerous you know. Malians is losing the Dark Age bonuses. Malians don't have the discount on the wood. So there is a zero bonus for all Nomad Sith. So what they want is just to make... All start in Nomad the same? I don't think that they are losing... That Malians is losing that. Malians is losing that too? I think Malians has... The dog uh, is still having the bonus. I don't know. Anyway... He has the loom, while red, no loom. Doing a house here, and... I love the dolphins, by the way. I really do. 
You can see the opening, guys. Three fishes is already one. It's crazy. And also with the extra food, you get resources and you don't get idle town center. Sick. Another fishy ship. And another one. He is still without the loom. And red is going away. He's doing a lambrican now. In front. I will do it at the back, but it's okay. He feels confident here with Persians, probably. That's true. So nobody, nobody will build anything. He has this the ship here used to put in between, but you can see guys how, how he's using the damn ship. Oh my God. He's an ass. Sito is an ass. It's a real ass. Seriously, man. Yeah. In a good way. Because if you are an ass on gaming, you are strong. You know what I mean, guys? I mean, don't take me wrong, okay? But guys, this game is over. Why this game is over? Well, he's going to lose a fish. He's not even up. He's gonna have now idle TC. No, actually. Look at the ship here. Okay. Why you are not able to do some policy like the Black Forest players, man? These these pro players are not what they what they should be, man. They they are fake, man. Look. Uh uh uh. Uh oh. oh. What the fuck, man? This is this is what happened just for telling this. And now he did a good job. Fuck. Now I look terrible as a caster. Okay, he did okay. Okay. Uh oh. He's gonna lose the villier. No, he saved it in the last second. Okay, he took the elephant and he's still not up. So, fire galleys, amigo. Fire galley and another one, fire galley. He's gonna make it. Well, Persians, guys, very strong. He's gonna take the water. He has 21 population. Mr. Yo, 22. The fish in the damn hell. Now he's gonna go up? Not really. And Mr. Yo don't even have the lumber camp. Oh, he did a mill, so it's okay. He can go up if he wanted. The, lo the lake is super, super big, so you can hide your fishing ships for sure. And now Blue is going to bring another elephant. All right. Yes, he will. And Mr. Yo is clicking up now. No. The mining camp is great. Gold and stone in the same spot. But Red, seems he went up super, super fast. He has no resources. And the ship? Where's the ship, guys? To help. The ship is in the hell. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. This is so annoying, man. Why you are able to do that, man? I want to learn. Who is going to coach me? Coach me that. Ooh. Two boars, man. Well, two rhinos. Sick. And now another one. Let's go. Good resources. So maybe he's not dead. And you can see how slow the game it is. Because even with controlling the water like he is. Stable, blasphemy. He's going to go fast castle. He's still dark age. Dark age forever. Yeah, Mr. Yo has no Lambricam. Lambricam is always great. You can make the uh, double attacks, which he's not going to be able to do it. He has six on wood. Oh, look at the wood he has. Like, not the best balance economy for Yo. Definitely not. He's going to make some scouts. Because he doesn't have the resources to go up. I mean, he has two rhinos. Nah. He just go castle each. Yeah, okay. Very nice. You have to sell wood. He has a lot. And market. And blasphemy. You swallow all the map. He's winning the other side. He's work like an outpost. I like it. And then he will wall. Till the edge of the map. He's doing the tone watch. Which is always a great upgrade. And red. is on the way to castle age. 
Sick transition to castle is by Sitol, man. Very nice. He can now buy the resources and go up if he wanted. Exactly what he's doing. He's on the way to castle. Age. The problem is, it's a minute. And uh, he's sending a scout. And uh, he's open. He's full open. Obviously, if you can make a castle and Janissas can be sick. But, hmm. The timing, the momentum, it's clear, guys, for who it is. Is this a wall? It is. And now he's coming through the town center. Not anymore. He's going quick, Mr. Red. Mm, the castle here. He should wall completely, but he's not walling. Gold and stone. Red can't see it. This is a great mining camp, man. Skill bar in armor and it's not walling. Aye, aye, aye. Okay. He will have the stone. The berries is not protecting the berries. That's not good. You're gonna lose villages here. It's a skill bar in armor, guys. It's gonna lose few villages. Few villagers. Why he didn't protect? I don't know. And? Nah. The knights are coming. One knight already. He's gonna take the scout. Got it. But no. Two bullets down. Probably even three. If he play properly. Gonna take it. And? Seriously. Two bullets down. Sloppy. And? He has the stone to drop a castle. But this is looking terrible. As I told you, the timing, the momentum is so important in these maps. And these maps are super snowbally. I don't enjoy them because you feel like uh, they have a huge advantage from the start, one of the players, almost every time, for one reason or another, you know? But they do. It's true that you take the resources and you think, hey, Mr. Yo is fine, man. What are you talking? Eh. Not convinced when you have 24 villages and his opponent 35. You know? Not convinced. Okay. He wall it. Of course, Kola now. And? Still mining gold. He's doing farmers. He has no lumber camp. And zero village on wood also. Okay. He's repairing. And? Wood. He can't make the upgrades. Still no... No lumber camp. He's gonna make a lumber camp or not? He's gonna make a DC. No, not there, man. What the hell? Well, here he wants to take the, the ostrich, the berries, and the wood. I understand that. A monastery trying to convert the knights. Okay. I mean, he's doing what he has to do, but just look at this core difference. Because look at the... The village difference. It's just crazy. I mean, it, it's, a, it's a crazy difference right now. Yeah, he, with few army, he's just disturbing... Trying to move, the Janissas are coming, and he has to use the market to keep producing army, villages, anything. Yeah, still not a single abrid, only horse collar. He has four on food only. And now the monks? Uh, doing now the first monk, because he's at the limit with the goal. Nah. You need a lot of Janissas to make it work. He has no economy, man. It's, it's over. We're gonna see a decider, guys. In my opinion, at least. Like... Well, it's true that there is only 8 army. So, let's see. But the problem is that... He cannot really mass a lot. What is that farm? Goodness. Okay. Where's the monks? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's going to convert a knight. Or not? Not really. Tone center there? Or what is he planning to do? More stables. I mean, the previous series we have seen not the same approach, not the same civilization matchup, sorry, but same approach. Knights and monks versus versus the Janissars. Right? And he got knights and some monks. It all with a good economy difference. 20 villages already. Husbandry now. Let's see. 
Good farming. No more bullets on stone for Mr. Yo, who is having already a couple of bullets idle. And those Janissars are in danger to be lost. Because he's sending just two Janissars lonely. I mean, they are very strong, but they are not going to make a miracle. You know? Oh my god. Disaster, man. Okay. He's trying to kill some villages, but... Yeah, he's not an old army. He needs at least three monks. Together with the Janissas, at least. But he's coming with knights. The map is still open. He can come and destroy on his base. That's the biggest issue here. He's gonna make a TC now, but the timing, the momentum is not the greatest. Because if you don't wall... And is he gonna wall? Stone wall? And he don't... Well, just passing, but... Yeah, he got time and no reaction. That's weird. Like, seriously. Eh, this is over. I mean, look at the population, guys. Eh, it's just... It's just impossible. Really impossible. Okay. Oh my god. Well, with the six Janissars, he has a... Uh, he has a monk. He's not using... Now he has to be careful. The micro is not as smooth as you can see. And now he's doing another TC. Mr. Yo will never give up. Like, yeah, he won't give up. He's gonna keep trying over and over all the time. So maybe with the consistency he has and he can do the job. We'll see. I mean, Sito doesn't have yet millions of knights, but he's on the way. He's on the way. And he has Janice as a knight here too, so he can now raid. Okay. Yeah, the Janissas are really good. That's why he's staying, because he you knows that they're very dangerous. He's trying to convert another. And now he converted, but there's so many knights, man. So many knights. He's going to convert also back. And now with those knights, the Janissas will die. They will die, for sure. Yeah, he's getting destroyed, man. Look. Oh, my God. Ay, ay, ay. Nah, those maps... Those maps are decided by the civilization. I mean, the game is it's, uh, decided from the start. Because at this level, if you have a small advantage, you take it and uh, you can't recover. It happens also with Valas versus Hera. And with ACCM versus Sunday. No chance. When the civilization is a little bit better, in this non-TC start, it's almost impossible. You know? Yeah. He's not calling it, you know, he wants to be defeated or probably double the score. Okay. And he keep going. I mean, the game will probably not finish till Imperial. It's true that he can drop a castle forward, or he will try coming with more Janice, and he will he will try to drop a castle on his face to 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 make something to make something happen. But how? How? And you need to send twenty villages at least because you don't have army, man. He's sending how many? I put red point of view, okay? Oh! One down. Two down. Be careful now. And how many bullets are coming? It's coming with nine. But the castle is not that crazy. Like he's taking the tower and maybe the TC. But now he's gonna make his own castle too. Why he delete this table? To make it here? Alright. Well, if he can deny that... Ah! Do the spot. 
for the Janissaries. Really good, actually. Yeah, I mean, when you are in that very low position, how you send only nine villains, guys? It's crazy, man. It's not gonna make it, man. It's gonna. It's not gonna make it. Aye, aye, aye. Well, he did it because he attacked the Janissar in the last second. Did you see it? But uh, still, it's more than double the village, man. It's depressive game for me. <laughs> but mine for yo. Yeah, seed on wood, one on wood, 24, 22 on foot. Uh, still no, no village on gold for seed tall. Now he is. Three tone centers, two TCs, two castles. And he's doing petters. He's just killing the castle. He's gonna go rams even. Yeah, why not? We have a huge economy lead. Huge. Look at the score, guys. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it is what it is, you know? Yeah, well, of course that there is better civilizations, but, you know, it is what it is. Now the knights are going are going down, but he's gonna take the castle with the ram. But guys, seriously, it's crazy. How how Mr. Yo expect to come back here? Well, it's true that that Sito don't have a lot of army. He does have a lot of army, not really. So that's why he's staying in the game. It's like he, he can't really kill me. But he knows that his economy is a big difference. Nah. The nice die. Every hit is a night dead. Yeah. Kill it. Oh my god. They are so strong. Another castle is gonna be down. No more problems. And well, we have to wait, guys, till he reaches Imperial. Till Sito reach Imperial. Hype two mem hype two for KOTD5. Thank you, man. KOTD5 gonna be sick. I hope so. So, Mr. Yo won't resign till Imperial. I believe. No? I mean, I think so. Nah. He took an spawn forever. He's gonna take it. Took it. Yeah, it's true. It's true that you can notice how his macro is not the greatest. Two thousand wood right now. Obviously, it's not the same to fight like this, like in arena, like Hera did in the previous series, because the, the map is a lot closer arena, and then you have all more located in a same position well here you have all over the map it's more confusing but over 2000 wood just makes 60 farmers man that's why he's not really killing 100 percent in the previous series here and similar approach he got like 70 farmers you know well here um uh, sito is just adding villages but all the village has you can see this is the the gather point and he's not controlling the macro this is the difference you know now he's selling all the wood okay Doing another TC. But your population is ridiculous. Yeah, why he's not doing the plus two now? Just make the plus two, man. Estelle. Many knights. Gonna keep going. You gonna take the monk or not? Not really. So he convert a knight. Now he's gonna come, he's gonna take it. And well. We're waiting, guys. We're waiting that Mr. Yo... Nah. Sito, man. Go Imperial, man. 2,500 score difference. Holy moly. 120 valets, 60. Double the valets difference. Doing another mill and another one. A lot of farms now, finally. Okay. Sito to relics get the third one. And now raid... I mean, just look at the economies uh, Mr. Yo has. It's a terrible economy. 
Well, now, just drop a castle here and you're fine, 100%. Or not. I don't know. This Imperial. It's going up. Go, go, go. Precious Seco, man. Click up Imperial, man. Let's go. Oh, man. These games are really crazy, man. It's, it's frustrating for me to cast these games because Mr. Yosu call it, man. I mean, he should call it long time ago. But still, he's gonna go up to Imperial. You, you gotta be kidding me, right? But he's gonna go up to Imperial with half the villages. Yeah, look at the resources. He's gonna kill this or not? Whoa! Converted two. And now, the, the crazy thing is that... Sito is still no, not an old army to dominate. Yeah, but now he's coming with another castle. Couple of dice. Look at the Janissars. Gonna take more. Oh, the monk is down. Now better micro by, the, by, by, by Yo. You have to be careful, man. What the hell? Yeah, he's not up to Imperial yet. Mr. Yo. Mr. Yo want to make a castle here, but you need a lot more villages. I mean, yeah, the castle he's doing is not even great. You see the downhill is... It's just a... Oh, ma, ma, ma. Castle. Was trying to go forward, but he can't. Still more army. 146 population, 84. And well, and tomorrow, guys, remember the semi-finals start at 14 GMT. Problem is, well, problem is that the starting is the the pizza, which is a map that, in my opinion, is very tricky and very and very possible one. to be unfair. So let's Scarface, Scarface, thank you so much for the tier three subscriber, man. And this Doubt Castle, 99%. At least now, call it. Thank you, man. He needed that he reach Imperial and make a castle 99% to call it, man. My goodness, man. Mr. Yo, like, Sito was like, if I got an appointment, I will never go because Yo will never, will never quit, right? Yeah, man. Great castle, military. Uh, Sito kill a lot more. Economy, ridiculous. 20,000 almost resources more. Crazy, man. But, well, we're going to have a decider, which is always better. We keep going, guys, with game number three. Decider, alas, from this Jordan Medieval Brawl Season 2. Yucatan. Berbers. Versus the Kumans, amigos. Berbers versus the Kumans. All right. And this is going to be Sito as a red berbers in the north and then the Kumans in the south. A little bit more open looks this Yucatan. Not too much. But the thing here is you need a crazy strategy with Kumans because if the game go for the late game, berbers dominate Kumans in my opinion, 100% in late game. But Kumans, in a map like this, that they are so far. A double TC. Boom. Oh, man. Sick. Sick. Let's see. Let me try to show you the overlays, guys. Berbers. Kumans. Is there? Is not. Because there's some problem. Okay, give me a second. I need to refresh, guys. And now it should work. I believe so. Let's see. I have some problems with my overlays, but uh, small, small book with the refresh. It's still not working. Mikael will let you. Yeah, I have to refresh this crap. Now he's there. Berber versus Kumans, guys. And he's doing what he has to do. Wall completely. And go for the second TC. But then, what is Sito going to do? He's already sending militias. But he's a wall. And wall here, and he's fine. Completely fine. <laughs> well, let's see, man. What civilization is favorite here, guys? Kumans or Berbers? And what do you want to win? Kumans or Berbers? You know? 
Will there be Betis on this game? The Betis are there. It's about to finish, but you are blind. Three militias is kinda too much. But... Oh man, he's gonna kill the deers. That's not good. He has no loom. Oh my god. Oh my god. What is he doing? What is he doing? But, but what is he doing with that village? Oh my. What? He's so slow. Yo. Yo. Wake up. Well, he's up. Where he's gonna make the TC? I don't know, man. You need the DS. You don't want to get lame it, man. But this is a sloppy, in my opinion, for Sito. Like, Mr. Yo is up without the loom. And Sito is now going around for the worst spot possible. Yeah. Okay. I will do the TC here, man. I don't know if he's going to make it there, but I will do the TC here. Perfect. Would... DS and goal. Seriously. Tone center here is perfect, man. Perfect, please. Do it here. Yeah, man. Now people think that I am a good caster. You see, guys? I'm a great caster. I'm telling you. Uh oh. It's not gonna save that Valir. And it's still without the loom, man. It's still without the loom. Menstradamus. In the house. It's crazy that he's gonna take the scout, man. Oh, he got it. It's important. And now he need to make this TC before he's coming because he can take the deers. It's taking a long time, but you don't want to lose those. Oh man, it's still without the loom. Oh, he killed it. And you don't have loom, man. You don't have loom. You don't have loom. The loom. Fill it down. Ay, ay, ay. The fuck why he's not doing the loom man now he's doing the loom unbelievable but you kill is it one hp man yeah i think this this malicious has been a big waste i don't know what you think big waste of resources for sito do you think those militias did any damage i mean one valir for three militias kill it what do you think guys yeah, one player is nothing. In my opinion, is nothing. And then he lost the scout himself, so he can't explore. Oh! Castle drop. I like it, man. I like it a lot. But if he wall completely the map, then the castle drop is useless. Because a castle drop... A good castle drop should be inside, on his base. You know, and blue... Gonna knows exactly what he's gonna do. Yes. He see... Barrack, but he also see Blasmith, Market, and he need to find the stone miners to see the mining camp. He can see now. This is how important a scout is. So there's few options. You keep booming, or if he has resources, which he doesn't have resources, yeah, yeah he can't. He can't make now Barrack an army. You know, he doesn't have anything, so he's just gonna wall. And keep booming with the second TC. Well, the game is very interesting. Like, really, really interesting. Completely different with the previous one. This is much better. Usually, when these Kumans involve... Oh, make the wheelbarrow, man. Make wheelbarrow and double attacks. Holy moly, man. Double attacks is done. And wheelbarrow, you're housed. Doing Tone Watch, okay. Tone Watch is good. But it's fully walled, guys. Fully wall. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Eight villain is more for Mr. Yo. But he's still one minute away from Castle Age. Now what is he going to do? Do you think, guys, he should... He should make Siege break and then go in with the castle or just drop the castle right away i honestly think that he need to get inside and deny it one tone center because if not mr yo will have a still an insane economy he's gonna try to break the palisades 
or, or, or what? Castle here is... I don't like it. Now Mr. Yo will wall here and here and that's it. You only need to ignore the berries. Just wall this area. You see? Mark it. Wall this area. Like this. And it's perfect. Well, it's doing the same but forward. You know? I was just doing here because it's safer. Close to the TC. Doing the houses. And what he's doing is for nothing. Because now, Mr. Yo has also a stone at the back. That he can't see it if he wanted to take it. I'm not sure if this is wall. I think it is. There's not a hole, right? No, there's not a gap. Yeah. I think that castle is total crap. I mean, total crap. He's just not doing anything. Like, he's doing camel arches, so what? Doesn't matter. Now, Mr. Yo can do whatever he wants. He's gonna make a lambrican, he can do barracks. He's gonna mine a stone, too. Yeah. But, I'm not sure about that. Like, I mean, if he's going for a fast imp, maybe. But is this a fast imp approach? No. Oh. Rams. Siege workshop. Are you gonna make it? He's doing already. There's two bullets that I cannot see properly, but you can see there now. You see now? Yes, you do. Yeah, well, a Magonal. He will have the Siege workshop there. He's mining a stone. And maybe he's gonna try to make a cast of forward. Knowing Mr. Yo, anything can happen. Because Kipchak, they just die. I mean, the Camel Arches, <clears throat> sorry guys, they eat the Kipchak, like 100%. So, well, let's see. He's doing now the Obama, the Barak. But that's, in my opinion, a mistake. Because now he knows that if he's doing a Barak, he knows that he didn't have a Barak till now. Because usually you make a stable on RT range because they cost 100 wood only. The Barak cost more expensive. So he knows that either he's just gonna go boom or a castle drop as well. Which is okay, but it's good to hide your intentions as much as possible, in my opinion, at least. And now scorpions. The scorpions are great because these are not Magundays. They don't have bonus against them. Against the siege. Yeah, and red. Red don't even have fletching. Uh -huh. So the thing is, he's 16 delays behind, he has two tone centers, and didn't make any damage. For good for doing this, it's probably better to go boom directly. Anyway, it's easy to say now what that we see, right? But you know. No no, Mr. Yo is going fast imp, guys. He's gonna he's going fast imp. Look his resources. Oh, another TC. Yeah, but it's still his echo is good. Well, maybe he just won three TCs even with the fast imperial. All right, he's doing a siege workshop, and Mr. Yo will just make a castle here, maybe. Oh, he's doing the upgrades, so, so no fast imp anymore. He will just keep booming, and a castle to defend. 17 villages ahead, yeah, probably that. I mean, to be honest, you don't need a fast imperial right now. Your economy is a massive advantage. You just make a castle to defend. Blue is exploring all the map, as you can see. The score difference is insane, and Mr. Yo, at least that he's doing at some big Titanic in this game, might be in the semifinals tomorrow, guys. Camel Archers with Fletching now, uh, right, and a Magonel. Very nice. He's doing a Magonel too. He's reacting, but he's fine. Who is gonna make the castle? He has a stone right now. Uh -uh. Okay, the Mangola is coming, and if he if he kill it, it's just gonna make the castle. I think he should make the castle here. His economy is a massive advantage. Yeah, you need to deal with the Mangola. And he's doing the castle there anyway. He doesn't care. Yeah, because he's not in the range of the Mangola, this area. He's just a very safe play by, by Yo. And uh, easy one. All right, all right. Yeah, 20 farmers, a lot of wood. Just make more farms. Another TC, okay. Another town center. 
can still sit down on 20 villages more. So the only thing that could save here Sitol is to be up to Imperial faster than his opponent. Which is not going to happen. He has a stone for another castle. He's doing now Botkin Dam Arrow. And he's coming with a Magonal. He has another Magonal there. Okay. Yeah, defending, defending guys we have said many times is much easier than attack. Now, uh-oh. Uh-oh. One for one? No. Nope. Prepare. One for one now. That's good for you. And if he kill now that one... Oh, man. Yeah, he's gonna make a cast of forward. He's trying to make really aggressive now. I like that. He got the kill. Now it's gonna be difficult for him to kill there, but... He's up to Imperial, guys. He's on the way to Imperial. Good castle. Yeah. I mean, that's a good castle because he's scanned that corner. He's like lock on that area. Oh boy. And one for one? No. No, 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 no. Oh, one for one now. Oh shit. That's good for you. Because he's ahead and because he was with Hill. Yeah, man. And now what? Just trebuchets? And. Like it? What is he gonna do? He started to make more farms. 20 bullets more still. And uh, as you can see, Sito is getting there, but the problem is that he's 22 villages behind. So his economy is going to be much weaker. He's going to go up to Imperial. Yes, he will. He got an amazing unit, Camel Arches. He got Botkin already, but the timing, the momentum, and the economy is much better for, for Yo. Much better. And he's 1 minute and 30 seconds. He has only one castle, so... He might not be able to do traps and oath. Well, he has almost the stone to make another castle. He's gonna make it here, maybe? Is he spam what the hell? Is he spamming his tables? Yeah. He's spamming his tables, amigo. Oh boy. And the army is gonna be what? He's gonna make a castle forward. I like it. Oh. He lost it. He's inside. Oh! He's inside now. I I I. And now that castle is dangerous. It, it is dangerous. What is Mr. Yo doing? What is he doing? Is it still open here? Oh my god. Good way to throw. A good way to throw. He's gonna lose a lot. And he still have no army. Chain bard in armor. Still, he's doing lancers. Okay. But he's getting some map control there. It's still Mr. Yo has single army. Now three. Because he's doing the lancers. Losing ability here. Okay. Stop calling me, man. What the fuck is this? He's gonna kill the mango like he will. But now he still have the camel archers there. He's crazy, man. How he let him inside. And if he's not doing that castle, it's a problem. He's gonna make another mango. Okay. But, but but this is the problem, guys. The the advantage was that massive that he will losing like this now, ten villages already, and losing a lot. It doesn't matter, man. He's still thirty villages ahead. You know, he is still thirty villages ahead, which is incre incredible, right? It, it's crazy. It's just really crazy. Those lancers are now plus four, and the thing here is. It's doing chemistry to have bomber cannons. I like it. The camel arches are great units. But... Lancers are coming. Uh-oh. Plus four. We lost another villain. And... Yeah, but he does have the plus three. There is a castle too. Uh-oh. Light caps. Mr. Yo is having problems to finish the game. Not playing that smooth, right, guys? Definitely not. Definitely not. Yeah, he does have a lot of resources in the bank. And this castle is in danger to be lost. What the hell? That castle is being repaired, but now you have to repair two castles. Same. Same for Mr. Yo. It's repairing also. Uh-oh. 
Is he doing bomber cannons? Not really. He has no wood. He has no resources. Oh, man. Doing another trap. Okay. Also, no relics for any of the players. Now, it's mining a stone here. The castle is going to be down. It's mining a lot of stone. That's good. Yeah, and well, the thing is that Mr. Yo is just winning with the Echo. He he has a huge amount of Elise more. Like, look at C top population. He's at the limit, you know? At the very limit. He's now going to try to kill that one. You need to buy a stone and repair. But he's going to try to kill the light gas before. And if he kill those, he stick both castles. He's going to be terrible, right? It will. Repairing that castle. He didn't repair, but now what Sito has? These camel archers, that is four camel archers and one bomber cannon. Disaster. He has nothing, man. He really has nothing. And he can't really... Yeah, it's... It's over. It's fully over. Look at the score, guys. Look at the damage score. Oh, boy. Oh, really, boy. Well, it was kind of expected when you are with the Kumans and you are not getting attacked in early game. But pfft, your economy is huge. That's why this this choice is so solid for this one. Well, it's micro in here. <laughs> Look at the traps. Is he going to send army or not? Kassar upgrade. Yeah, it's GG, man. And he's not even walling here. Not another TC. He has a lot of wood. Now 64 farmers, which is huge. And now with the Kassars, fully upgraded. We'll kill the camel archers. That's a matter the village. Just look. He has killed more village than his opponent. Now he's doing camels. I like Sito. You know, a lot. His attitude, man. It's just trying, going with the camels. Because, you know, the camels will, will take those units. But the problem is that he can do army forever. And, guys, Mr. Yo, GG call with the domination. The APM is super lower in comparison with the others. But... That's something that we have seen already many times. We don't have to repeat, right? But we have to check everything in statistics. Military, he killed similar. But guys, it was all about the civilization again. That map, Kumans, you don't attack or don't attack properly, you are dead. And he was dead. He is in the semifinals. Thumb up on YouTube, guys. Hopefully you have enjoyed.